now to quintessential English, or is it Greek? Donuts. Ooh. Donuts English or they're Greek? What's Greek. What, what are your ones? Lukumades. Lukumades. Mm. I find lukumades a bit chewy though. I love chewy. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to make English donuts and they're just a good dough, a good yeast dough that are just tossed in sugar. I'm going to put lavender in this one. So if uh, you can just I'll crumble some lavender out of there, into there, and just rub it into the sugar. So it, dis it dissolves in the sugar and you get that lavender flavour in, into the sugar. Yep. Now, <coughs> you're all right there. You eat your own food. You're eating your own souvlaki, I choking to death. Right. Lavender lamb, it's a great combination. <laughs> now, what I've done here is I've warmed up a couple of cups of milk. I've got some yeast, and there's about 10 grams of yeast, and about a quarter of a cup in sugar, just to sweeten it up. And I'm using my fingers, don't be afraid. Chefs do use their fingers when they're cooking, just to dissolve that. And I need to use my hand because the milk must be at blood temperature. And that's around about, who knows what that is? <coughs> 37. Right. Now, I've got about four cups of flour, and that liquid is going to go into the, into the flour. So remember, oh, George, what? don't forget the eggs. Oh, the eggs. So, oh, I tell you, I'm getting old, I'm forgetting stuff. So four eggs, right? Let's give that a little bit of a whisk. Come right. on, come Break on. it up, spill it all over come the bench, on. love it. See, in my own restaurant, I've got people that tidy up behind come me, on. but today I've got to do my own washing me. up. All right, you pick right. the lavender in there. So yeah. whisking, right. whisking in the liquid into the flour, and I'm going to end up with a very yeah. soft mixture, which is unlike most right. donuts, because what no, you normally I'm have done, is a... Gary, I'm out of here. Oh, I've got good, our, our new chefs taking job, over. Kids. Hey? You know what that means, don't you? You get donuts. Yeah, you, if you stay up here, you get some donuts. How about that? <laughs> hey? Right. No, we don't want the stalks. You, you can leave them for Gordon's so, class. George, yeah. be quiet for a second. Look at that. Right? It looks too sloppy. You're looking at that. If you've made a traditional donut, That's you make a dough. You knead it. So you can take you these. You make little balls out, out of it. And then you roll them up and you fry them. Now, this is delicious because it's soft. And the softer the dough, the lighter the donut. Okay? Put it into a piping bag. Let it prove. And what you'll end up with is this thing. All right? Ooh. Oh, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Master Chef judges take out right? kids. It's, it looks really weird, but what happens is the yeast, feel that, feel that, it's have great. a squeeze. You can go swimming Ooh. with it. Yep, it's like a little flotation device. What happens is it aerates because yeast lets, um, as a byproduct, lets uh, carbon dioxide go. So it aerates it, and that's why bread rises, okay? So once it's puffed up, God, I hope these work, George. Oh. I'm out of breath from all that running around as well. We set the top off. Oh, oh. Gary, not too soon. Oh, gee. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, George. Sorry, sorry, kids. I'm down. <laughs> they didn't get it. It was okay. <laughs> Shh, don't laugh. <laughs> We're not in the kitchen now. <laughs> right. George, I can't believe I know, believe I it. know. I keep forgetting it's right. Sunday. And what we do is little nuggets piped into the, into the fat. All right. Dads, pay attention. Look, Kids, you're on TV. Get your dads to, to make sure he makes donuts like this because you'll be the most popular dad on the street. All right? Whoop. Very easy. Didn't look hard, did it? <coughs> and what will happen is as it hits the fat, you get this little kick from the yeast and they aerate and they become little round balls, as you can see. And they take about four minutes in the fryer and you'll have these beautiful little light donuts. George, have you got the racing on? What is that noise? I don't know what's out there. I think it's Matt. Always has the racing on on a little transistor, George. He's getting Just ready for Get when he turns 60 and he's that little old Greek man, you know, that shuffles along the road and he's got his transistor <laughs> and his socks and his thongs on. <laughs> hey, you know what's actually quite funny? I saw Gary using his fingers to mix the yeast up. We've got any bloggers in the audience? Any bloggers? bloggers? Right, ma'am, you can leave, please. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Now, I jumped on the M MasterChef website, read the forum, and they were saying, bad Gary, bad George for licking their knife when they're tasting the food. <laughs> bad etiquette, arms on tables. I mean, come on, guys, get a life. I mean, you know, we're tasting food. Get a life. So you see what's happening here? They're just, uh, oh, look at those oh, they beautiful, beautiful little beautiful. round donuts. You're going to get a little donut. 
Yeah. So we got that. A bit of clotted cream. I had a little dish. There we go. <coughs> Just need a spoon. And then we'll fill some with jam. And then we'll consider running a few into the audience, maybe. All right. Let's have a look at these. Still going? Yeah. Still going. Did you Beautiful. say yeah? Did I say yeah? Oh, no. Oh, no. George says yeah. Mm. Does it drive you nuts or not? Yeah! Losers. <laughs> you just said yeah. <laughs> I what? can't help it. I don't know what it is, but when, when I'm talking about food to them, I, I just keep saying it. And it's like, oh, stop saying it. You know anyway. what, what's great about it is now George is doing a charity dinner for who? Yep, for the zoo. For Raising the zoo. money. Oh, and oh. big t-shirts with George says yeah yep. on it. It's sold out. A sold Fantastic. Out. Great. The power of the media for a good cause. Fantastic. If you're interested, we're also at the Maribyrnong Bo Boathouse going to do a dinner in July for <laughs> Brumby's Babes which is um, raising money for the Peter McCallan Institute, which is a good cause for research in cancer. And you're welcome to book. I don't think George is going to be there. You're going to be in Greece. Yes, I will. And I'm going to try and get Sorry. Matt along. And I'll be there, of course, cooking. Let's see if these... Are these cooked, George? Have oh. a feel. Tear it up. Let's have a look. Oh, they look amazing. Oh. Beautiful. Right, let's go. Mm. Mm. I don't... Shall I fill them with jam or not? Uh, no. No. Let's fill, let's fill a couple with jam. What type of Aussie are you? <laughs> Got to have jam. Right. A little piping bag like that. Can we get four in for the, the little jam. girls, please? Yeah, there's four. I, I, we need to, I need to make it up to them. Right. George, plate. Yeah, I'll take it. There you go. Oh, All right, you got me. that one. Yep. Great. One, two, three, four. Right, you got 50 bucks for a donut. <laughs> right. Here you go. There's your donuts. Now let them cool down a little bit because yeah, they're still a bit hot. A bit hot. All right. And then you've got to break out in a song, all right? Okay. Right. Who wants a donut? 